My dear friend, this is your Dr. Paneer Salvam on behalf of Grobi Consultancy. Again, we are resuming the food process training. Food, you know, that is very, very, very important. But uh, prepare a tastier food, it is always good. And to take the hygienic food, it is far, far good. And if that is going to be vitamin based, fantastic. If the food has a pakka, first class nutrient food, that is excellent. But is it possible to make on your own? Sometimes you may not be aware of it. Millet, it has a wide number of preparations. And if you take cereals, it has a wide number of varieties. So for which I think the training is vital because everybody cannot learn. And just you listen to some media or videos, you cannot prepare the food which you have a dream. So come back to again to Nirbala Balu to look up the trainings. Nirbala Balu is a multifaceted trainer. So I have made use of her for making the foodstuff items. So now here are you no know, South Indian items, North Indian items. The item is also home, uh, homely made food. So that all possible only with this uh, dynamic and efficient and well known and certified trainer. So which uh, uh, her skill can be used by us to prepare a, diet, a very good delicious for uh, the wealthy and healthy life of our family members. Make use of the opportunity. You can see her training both boys and girls on different products. You can look at it. Pani Puri can be prepared by anybody, but type of flour and the type of oil and that will give the uh, good healthy food which requires a skill, which requires to be taken up as a training. That training is important for making the very good tastiest buri. You can see the trainees of both sex, male and female, take an intensive uh, training to prepare a very delicious food which will uh, be the qualitative and uh, tastier and hygienic. So with that you can see here. Whatever may be the number of buris, all buris will have to be uniform, absorbing the similar quality of oil and the type of very good flour. So it everything is uh, uniform and qualitative. Trainer explains how it will have to be prepared. So then they have taken the method of preparation and again they replicate and uh, prove that they are also able to make the similar kind of products under her supervision. It is not only a demonstrative training, it is a handhold training so that everybody can learn out of their practice. So for which the intensive training is provided. The trainees here take a trial and prepare by themselves and ensure whether it matches the quality which is already given by the trainer. So if any variation, they try again and again to ensure the correct quality. They move on to the North Indian dish again. So now it is our Babaji. So here also I think the training is given from the scratch. How the things will have to be prepared at each level. And again the self life the product. And how it will have to be provided with the qualitative preparations and tasty preparations. Everybody takes a training. As we know this, uh, samosa are prepared uh, with the peas and again uh, potato and sometimes adding uh, tomato. But now here it is uh, made up of uh, onion. But onion is good for health and it's uh, tastier also and looks different and also good for health. And potato we do agree it is good but uh, onion is uh, far better than this uh, potato. So this is also taught by the trainer to prepare the dish uh, type of uh, dish. This food is uh, not only preferred by the North Indians. It is widely popular and uh, widely used by the uh, South Indians also. This is also very tasty. Moreover, during this uh, summer, this because of this uh, curd uh, is mixed with the buri, it is uh, very easy or very tasty to eat and very delicious. And not only the adults, even children also like to taste this food. Food preparation is art. Because you know, from hand to hand, from men to men, from woman to men, it varies. So now to give you a very good tasty to your family members or if you rent the hotel to your customers, that is really a skill and art. If you are success, definitely you know you will have a client of clients and family members after family. It's a North Indian dish, but mostly it is uh, I mean uh, introduced by the West Bengal people. It's uh, meant for Calcutta. So it is another taste because I had something uh, another ingredient which will give you more taste. There are varieties of uh, guruma prepared for buris, whether it is uh, potato based or onion based or uh, tomato based. 
now this is an art because you no know, to you provide a different decision every day to your duri that will be attracting the tongues of the people there is overwhelming interest among the participants and everybody wanted to take a trial out to demonstrate the training and prove that they are able to make as per the training which they have taken so now you see that you know people try to prove that they are preparing a, a tastier food as well as a qualitative food it is nothing but a passing on training now a person who got trained is helping or is guiding or teaching or training other candidate to know about the products you can see here it's a curd rice but it is mixed with the bellets but that's really fantastic for health you know how it has been attracted and designed so anybody will have a you no know, that is a water mouthing to taste this food so this food will give you first class energy first class you know kind of uh, vitamin and calcium and protein so much of contents to your body in the food process training everything is not how to chop your vegetables and how much is the size should it be and how will it to be mixed for your fried rice how it let to be done for your dosa or how it is to be made for chapatis each one differs so everything is an art to learn and that can be provided by the training you can see the trainer is giving a training meticulously and tasting the dish and sharing with the trainees what the how the quality has been brought up so this is nothing but a meticulous kind of sharing this is one of the output you know it is a uh, snacks which you can take uh, for your children or a hotel in the um, either the morning or the evening so by outlook itself i think uh, don't feel that it is mixed with the chemical powders it's all natural powder so it could be taken the training gobi 65 is invariably taken by all age groups all gender it's a very tasty dish and it probably one of the one of the best uh, side dish the food process training is endless you can prepare as you like because you know the tank is a slave of it to the taste of the food so every day you can plan for different types of diseases dishes which could be possible only by way of taking some kind of exposure without that you know you cannot make out very easily to make your food not only taste but also make it attractive for your family members or the clients in the hotels so the art of preparing a good product good uh, food product it requires a training and again no kind of a process uh, method even you can see that how the, the fruit has been uh, definitely you know the vegetable has been prepared in such a way looking so attractive so uh, again so this is again and the millet out made bagoda bagoda you know that only kadale maavu but now it has been made with the millet it is not only tastier but also good for health and the method of preparation is very important to learn it and when you move to this manjurian gobi manjurian it's invariably liked preferred by all age groups which you can prepare after taking a good training it's available so decide yourself if you want to prepare a very different dishes and that is qualitative and very tasty here whether it is for your family or for your commercial purpose you call us for your requirement of training thank you very much